Hi guys! Um, it is time for a spring Sephora haul. So I'm going to go through my stuff from Sephora that I've gotten in the mail recently. And I'm going to have another haul soon. I don't know if you know this or not, but Sephora had their 15 days of beauty celebrating their new website. If you want to buy something and you didn't buy anything for their 15 days of beauty, you can go online and they still have stuff available. So when you go to checkout, you do have to spend over $25, but just type in the number one five, then days. And then you can pick which kind of mini thrill you want. So we should do that soon because once the stuff is gone, it's gone forever. So we're going to start off with hair products. I got um, Bumble and Bumble Surf Spray. Um, the bottle is kind of rubbery feeling. I don't know why, I guess on their website I thought it looked like it was glass, so I thought that it was like frosted kind of glass. It's not. Um, and then this is the little tag thing that you take off to spray it, but I do keep the tag on because um, I do travel obviously with hair products and stuff, and I don't want it to like somehow end up spraying everywhere. So I do really like this, by the way. Lots of these products I can actually review because I've tried them and I really like them or I don't like them. Um, some things I can't review, but this I really liked. You know, I just spray it on my dry hair and it keeps the curl in because I naturally have wavy hair. I think if you didn't naturally have wavy hair, it might not work as well. It definitely it holds like the waves in and stuff. I really like it and also smells yummy. That was one thing. The next hair thing is by Ojon, Ojon, and it is a damage reverse restorative smoothing glaze, and you put it on after the shower on your damp hair. And I was really, really excited to try this product. I think it was about $26, and the surf spray, I believe, was $28. Um, I unfortunately am going to have to return this because it has wheat protein, and I have celiac disease, so I can't eat anything with... Uh, wheat, barley, malt, rye, flour, oats, blah, blah, blah. And while I'm not eating this, it is going on my hair and it tells you not to rinse it out. So I would keep it on my hair all day. I touch my hair all the time. I know you're not supposed to, but you know, and I'm eating food and so I would probably eat it and I don't want to get sick. And I'm going to talk about all the little freebie mini thrill things that I got at the end. The Beauty Blender. And I got their exclusive set that you can only get at Sephora, so I'm really excited to show you guys. It comes with the Beauty Blender itself. This, it's drying right now. Um, but this is what it looks like. It's like sort of egg-shaped. It's very squishy. It's, it's, I really like it. I mean, I used it this morning, and it did a really, as you can see, I used it this morning. Um, <laughs> I used it damp. I think if it was dry, it would give you lots more coverage, but I didn't feel like I needed a lot of coverage. Um, and they tell you you should keep the pedestal, this little thing here, so that when you're done washing it, you can let it air dry right here, and, um, the air will flow better, obviously, than if you just, like, put it on a solid surface, like, that bottom part's not going to dry very well. So there's that, and then it also comes with the cleanser, it's a beauty blender cleanser, the ultimate makeup sponge cleanser, and it's great for makeup brushes, too, it says, put that right there. Um, I can tell you it smells good, um, but it is very soapy, so very little amount will go a really long way. And I don't know if you can see, oh yeah, you can see this part right here. That's how you get the stuff out. I was really confused. <laughs> you put your finger here and you press, and then the soap will kind of fill up the little space, and then you take your beauty blender and you squish it in, and then you, you know, do your thing to um, clean it. So, really like the beauty blender so far. I've been wanting to get it for about the past three years, I would say, so it was kind of a big deal to be like, okay, this is actually something I'm going to buy. That's $34. I got DKNY's Be Delicious, which I've also wanted for the longest time. Every time I walk into Macy's, I'm like spraying myself with it, and I'm like, yeah, I'm going to smell good all day. So I really, really like this, and I'm really glad I finally bought it. It was, it's a limited edition, um, and... Because it's limited edition because it's 0.5 ounces, but it comes in this thing. It comes in the same kind of container, but you do have to take the top off here, and then you spray it like that. Oh, I can smell it. It smells so good. 
So this is what it looks like. The packaging is really cute, but I really like the smell. And there it says, be delicious. But you can't see that, can you? Because my little spotlight thing is in the way. If you ever go into a Macy's or a Sephora or anything like that, please try this. It's really good. I really, really like it. That's everything that I bought. And now I'm going to go on to my little mini thrills for 15 days of beauty. So one of the things I got, Fumble and Bumble Straight Blow Dry. I was going to buy the full size, it's 4 ounces, but I really like to try things before I buy them. So this is what it looks like, and I was really confused at first because I was like, what's up with the cap? But you twist the cap, right, like that, tip it upside down, squirt however much you want in your hand, and close it by twisting. So the whole thing happens by twisting, um, which I think is kind of cool. Um, that's probably not how the full size thing works, but this is a deluxe 2 ounce size. So that's really good. I got this for free. I mean, not really, because I spent $25 plus, dollars, but anyway, I have not had the chance to try this, so I can't really review it. Next thing I got was Bumble and Bumble Texture Hair Undressing Cream. Looks like this. And it works the same way. Little twist thing. Unfortunately, if you do want one of their 15 Days of Mini Thrills, these are all gone. Um, I have tried this. I do like it, um, but if you want volume, you're going to have to really like work it into your roots like crazy just to kind of get that volume. So, but I do like this. I think it's cool. I mean, it's not like doing anything great for my hair. Another mini thrill I got was this, and I was like, oh my gosh, I'm going to order something today just so I can get this. It is the Urban Decay Eyeshadow Primer Potion, and in case you don't know me, which none of you really do know me. <laughs> um, let's be honest. This is my favorite beauty product of like ever of my life. I mean, not really, but it's like out of the normal beauty product range of like eyeshadows and lipsticks and lip glosses and blushes and foundations and concealers and all that good stuff. This is my favorite, like extra excess thing. Okay. Oh, I forgot something that I bought. I bought um, Rosebud Perfume Company Strawberry Lip Balm. And it literally smells like when you were a kid. You know, like when you bought those cheap like lip smacker lip balms and yeah. That's what it smells like. And I love the tin. It's very like old fashioned-y with the little strawberries around the edges. Um, it was $7, but I love it. It was sort of just a, hey, I, I'm, I need $7 added to my cart. Great, I'll buy this. But, like, I haven't tried it. But it smells really good. <laughs> Last mini thrill was, um, I, well, I checked the box for the Dior sampler that they were giving away, but instead they sent me this huge bag filled with two things. So, and it comes with one of the things from the Dior sampler. The one thing that I didn't want. <laughs> it's a Dior Capture Total One Essential Skin Boosting Super Serum. The one thing in that Dior set I would not use. I was like, great, look at that gorgeous lipstick, great, look at that eyeshadow, I mean eyelash primer. Um, and then they also sent me Bare Minerals Finishing Touches On The Go Gems for Lashes, Lips, and Face. Which, honestly, I may just do a giveaway for because I'm not going to use this. It has the, a mini mineral veil, which I love Bare Essentials Mineral Veil, but I already have one. Um, the Pretty Amazing Lip Color, lip gloss thing or whatever, I have that same color of that lip stuff. And Flawless Definition Volumizing Mascara, I have that. So everything in here I love, but I don't feel like I need this. So, I may do a giveaway. I may decide to keep it. I don't know. We'll see. Okay. Thank you guys so much for watching. And um, I will see you guys next week, tomorrow, at some point for um, another Sephora haul. And I hope you guys are having a good day. My hair looks disgusting. It's not really. I took a shower. I swear. Oh, I just look so gross. Okay. So thanks guys for watching and I will see you later. And if you have any questions, if you want me to like go into some review on any of the products that I just showed you, please, please, please comment. 
message me, whatever, if you want to know any more about any of these products. I would love, love, love to tell you more. Um, and just a little disclaimer thing, Sephora is not paying me, nobody's paying me, nobody's sending me these products or anything. That would be really nice if they did. Because that's a lot of money I just spent on beauty products in the past like week and a half. If you want to send me money, go for it. <laughs> okay, thanks guys for watching. See you later. Bye.